Alright guys, so we're here today. I wanted to make another video for you guys. I really wanted to show you guys how you guys can get your UDM Pro and UDM Pro SE to get 2.5 and 5 gig. Alright. So, this video is here to show you guys how you guys, so it's the UDM Pro, remember the UDM Pro only gets 1 gig WAN or 10 gig WAN. The UDM Pro SE gets 2.5 gig, 1 gig, and 10 gig WAN. But with this device, you guys can get 5 gig, 2.5 gig on both of those devices. So it's going to be rocking and rolling. Hey, and if you guys like these videos, give them a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you guys don't miss any of these videos. So, this thing is so dang cool. I'm telling you what. So, basically, this connection right here, this one right here, this connection right there is, um, that's an RJ45. So, it's going to auto-negotiate to um, whatever. This can do 100 megabit. 1 gig, 2.5 gig, 5 gig, and 10 gig. 10 gig, it doesn't even matter. At that point, it literally does not matter at all because by that point, um, you can just use your SFP Plus anyways. You have an SFP Plus right there that does 10 gig. So unless your modem or whatever you're doing 10 gig, but then you can buy a transceiver that converts that uh, SFP Plus into an RJ45. They have RJ45 transceivers that can convert it, so if you don't want to run fiber or direct copper, you can change that. But if you guys have a modem, which most modems nowadays, they do have um, 2.5 gig on it. So who doesn't want to use 2.5 gig on their modems? Uh, so, I mean, if you have it, the speeds are going up there now. Everybody's increasing their speeds. So, I want to be able to use it. So, I found these media converters. I'm going to be looking for a fiber one, too. I've been looking so far, but not no results yet for the fiber converter for an SFP uh, plus 10 gig. That can, you know, downcycle the 2.5, 5, you know what I mean? All that stuff. But I'm going to be looking for that next. But So, stay tuned. Stay tuned. But uh, I just wanted to help you guys. So, there's two of these. So, basically, it's like a little switch. So the RJ45 port on it basically is going to be uh, your negotiation. So whatever's plugged into that, whatever speed it's running at, it's going to cycle through all those and say, oh, it's a five, 5 gig, this is a 5 gig, okay, there's a 5 gig link between these two. And then it has the SFP Plus port. So you can use um, uh, direct copper or you can use fiber and you can have it directly go into the 10 gig port on your uh, 10 gig WAN uh, on any of your SFP Plus ports that you negotiate to your WAN on your UDM Pro or UDM Pro SE. So then now, you will be able to have 2.5 and 5 gig on those ports. I mean, it's just awesome. And so people don't have to buy a new router. They can just keep using this. I mean, this is especially for businesses. And now here's another thing. If you're wondering, well, oh, that's another failure point. What happens if for some reason that thing messes up and or goes down? Well. If you have, you can get a smart plug from Unify, and, or if you have the PDU Pro, you can set this, that if there's no internet connection, you can set this to reboot too, so power cycle this too, just to make sure you can have it on there. So if your internet goes out, you can have your modem power cycle and this power cycle so that you can make sure that if you're not at home and something goes wrong, you can have this back up online, you'll be back up with internet. So yeah. It's pretty dang cool, and I just, I just, uh, I wanted to tell everybody here, if you guys want me to get one, I can't justify spending the money on all this, um, but I can do it for you. I mean, I'm fine with my speeds now, but if you guys want me to get more speed to test this out, you guys are worth it. I will definitely get it. I can't justify it, but you guys can justify it. So, please, let me know. If I get 150 likes in the next uh, two months, I will get this, and we'll rock it out. I promise you. So, yeah, and I'll give you my thoughts on it, the unboxing and all this. There's a couple of them I went through. I found a couple, so you just got to get in your price range. This one had really good reviews, um, but you can't always go by reviews because some people just don't know what they're doing, and some people do. So there's this one right here, 
Uh, so this one right here is $192 on Amazon. I'll be putting all the links for all these in the description at the bottom too, so you guys won't miss it. And then here's this one here. This one's a really expensive one, but I mean, th these, this one and this one are pretty close, but this one has a little less stars. I mean, a little less reviews. Uh, this one has a little more, but yeah, this, it looks awesome. Yeah, just plug and play. But yeah, hey, if you guys like these videos, help me out. If you guys don't like these videos, you know, you know what to do. But hey, the most important thing is you and your family are having a rock and rolling day. Uh, happy holidays to everyone. Um, I'm excited. I have a huge video coming out for you guys next week, so get ready. But this one, I know it's a shorter video, but I just couldn't wait. I had to tell people, I had to, it's Christmas time. I'm going to buy stuff for yourself. Or, hey, get me this. Or, wife, I, it's my turn to buy a present for myself. What do you want today? I think I'm going to get this so I get faster in it. Or if you're a business, you're just like, oh, this would help us get some more data rates over our internet connection. Yes, I want this this that's why i make this for you guys so rock on peace out and have a rock and rolling day i'll catch you on the next one